Here we have multiplication step 10. I can do smile multiplication. And as it's the beginning, we're just going to use the 2, 3, 4 and 5 times tables. Here we've got 4 multiplied by 30, 4 times 30. When we do smile multiplication, we draw a smile underneath the two numbers that we can already do because we know that 4 times 3 is 12. So we do the tables bit, then we count how many zeros we've got on the other side. We've only got 1, so we add 1 here. The reason behind that is because if it was just 4 times 3, that would be 12, but we've actually multiplied one of the numbers by 10. We've made it 10 times bigger. So the other side of the equal sign needs to be 10 times bigger as well. If we move on to something slightly more difficult, although it's not, let's do 40 times 30 instead. Again, do the tables bit. 4 times 3 is 12. This time we've got two zeros, so we add two zeros on. One that often catches people out is things like 40 times 50. Because when they do the tables bit, 4 times 5, the answer is 20. And they think, oh, I've already got one zero there, that doesn't matter. You've still got your two zeros on the other side, which you have to add on.